Hi folks, welcome back to another video from the audio filing car and it's another GR Yaris. So we've done a couple of extra bits on this vehicle that we don't normally do. Let's take you around the front and show you the first thing. So, just in case you're worried that your lights aren't bright enough and you're thinking about rallying, we've added a laser linear 18 elite light bar. We set that back behind the original grille and I think you'd have to agree that is pretty cool. It's all in there with stainless steel fixings, it's automated from the high beam. Um, it's extremely powerful and when it's switched off it's very very subtle. So there you go, just in case you fancy rallying your GR Yaris, you won't be short of light. What else have we done? We've added the full hi-fi pack. So this is the DSP hi-fi pack. I just happened to have left the laptop in there to show you a little bit about how the software works. Um, the uh, DSP based system means we've got the Audison speakers up front. I haven't brushed that A pillar down yet so you can see all of the Alcantara line in all different directions. It looks really pretty when it's brushed. You can have it up or down, depending on how you like the look. Um, obviously got the matching tweeter in this side as well. The Ron Axis are set into these A pillars. They don't add too much weight to the car, just in case that's what you're worried about. But it does get them behind that, behind, back from behind those nasty grills. We've done a huge amount of soundproofing in the door, as always. We've added a six and a half inch driver down there. We're using the brand new Audison Prima amplifier, uh, Audison uh, Forza amplifier with DSP. Um, this is the brand new uh, interface for it. It's very nice. It's much easier to use than the old sof software. And as we mentioned before, it's now standardized. So this bit of software is going to run all of the new Audison equipment. The amplifier is hidden away underneath, underneath this seat. You can't see it. It's completely tucked away. In the boot of the car, we have added a subwoofer. Let's just show you that. Underneath here, we've got the down firing subwoofer. But look what else we've done. We've added a lithium battery. So that's to reduce the weight to allow for the hi-fi. It's pretty cool. Um, it's a high power lithium battery. We've managed to get it in the original location. As you can see, it's quite a bit smaller. We've added some foam to the bottom layer to give it a nice soft base. And then we've taken the original GI Yaris brackets. We've cut them on either side. We've snipped a piece out and then we've re-welded them back together again. We've also shortened this block here to keep it away from the battery positive, the positive battery terminal. And got it all sound, uh, soundproofed it. We've sprayed it, we've made it look all look pretty and put it all back together. So there you go, if you're looking for a lithium battery upgrade, uh, we've done one now. It took us a bit of time to suss it out and refabricate the brackets, but once it's done, it's very neat. There's your subwoofer tucked away underneath the floor, bolted down on all the existing um, machine screw fixing, so we haven't drilled any holes for that. It's very, very solid, and we soundproofed the boot floor. Now, not only have we soundproofed the boot floor in this car, but the customer has also gone for our full soundproofing package. So for the GI Yaris, that means we've done the front doors, the whole floor pan, we've had the seats out done underneath there, we've had all in uh, behind the back seats, We've done the rear quarters, we've done the boot floor, so we've basically done everything in this GI Yaris apart from the roof. So this is significantly quieter on the road than a standard car. If you're just gonna race around it on a weekend, it doesn't really matter, but if you're gonna use it as a, as a daily or you're gonna do any sort of mileage at all, soundproofing makes a huge difference. So there you go, soundproofing, hi-fi, lithium battery upgrade, eight pillar builds, and a laser linear AT light bar on the front. This is one super Yaris. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you've enjoyed what you've watched. I'm going to add this to the GR Yaris playlist because if you follow us, you'll see we do a lot of them. We've got another one next week as well. Thanks for watching.